everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's vlog is all about how I manage a super busy day filled with a photo shoot, wedding, dress fitting, and filming content at home. I'll also be sharing five tips to help you master your schedule on busy days like this. So stay tuned throughout the vlog for all my tips and tricks. It's shoot day, this is look number one. Um, and I've just switched out some of my accessories just to give some different looks. Um, I'm about to go change into look number two. I can see Norman, it's right there in the red, um, but yeah. So I've been planning this photo shoot for a while and today is all about getting those perfect shots for my blog and social media. So tip number one is to plan your outfits and props the night before. That's literally what I use my iPad and I use the GoodNotes app because knowing exactly what you're going to wear and use during your shoot saves so much time and makes the process smoother. You'll definitely see me switching up my looks quickly which keeps the shoot moving along without any delays and I literally use my iPad as a checklist and just cross out everything right, just as it's look completed. Number two. All right guys, just finished shooting look number two. Got these boots from Zara. They're so comfortable and they are a true size 11 for all my size 11 girlies out there. All right. It's a little sneak peek of what my trunk looks like. All right. Scheduling look appointments back to back always help me keep to time, but always add a little buffer just in case you're running a little behind. But when I have a busy scheduled day, this just makes me feel better because I know that I'm gonna get more done in less time and helps keep me focused, especially during the photo shoot. And since I know I'm on a tight schedule, I just have to make sure that I'm efficient with my poses, with my content. I have my iPad to use as a checklist and make sure that after I change for each look, I bring the right props that I need. So later today, after my shoot with Norman, I'll be trying on a dress that I'm getting altered for my friend's traditional wedding in Atlanta. And I'm really excited for that, but I just knew that this day would be the best day to just, since I'm already out in the town and everything and get things going. Last look is now done and I'm about to head home. Hey guys, so here is my dress um, for the wedding I'm going to next week, Thursday. It was actually made in Nigeria, um, my tailor in Abuja, uh, but it just needed a few adjustments. So I came to Kala Studio here in Connecticut to um, do a few alterations. So I'm about to try my dress and show y'all. Here we are, y'all. Now that I'm home, it's time to get into content creation mode and keep the productivity going. So tip three, batch create your content. So for today, my makeup was already done. I'm already in a creating mood. So I'm going to take advantage of my energy and this time and film multiple pieces of content in one sitting. I like to film a lot of lookbooks and outfit of the day content in my living room. So today I'm working on content for Instagram Reels and YouTube all at the same time. And I do this by setting up well, literally by filming vertical and horizontally. And this helps me maximize my filming time and avoid having to get dressed all over and set up all over again. Isn't this set cute, y'all? It's from Kai Collective and it's literally one of my favorite matching sets. All right, so tip four. Have a content plan ready. I like to know exactly what I'm gonna film before I start, so most times I lay out my clothes already and with my camera, my lights if I'm gonna use it, a script if I need it, just helps keep me aligned. And again, I have my iPad to highlight, take notes, make sure that I hit all my talking points or make reference to any props that I want to. So, last but not least, tip five, it's important to take breaks. It's so tempting to power through, but take a few minutes to rest, drink some water, grab a snack, to help keep your energy up and ensure that you create the best content going forward. So that is a wrap today. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me for a busy day of juggling my photo shoot, dress fitting, and content creation at home. And remember, five tips for mastering a packed schedule are planning your outfits the night before, scheduling appointments back to back, batch creating your content, 
have a content plan ready, and take short breaks to recharge. If you found these tips helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and let me know in the comments how you manage your busy days. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!